Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, look at this beautiful live picture coming in from the WLKY Chopper HD. We're flying high above Churchill Downs on this wonderful early Thursday evening. Historic Churchill Downs with the twin spires right there. Crowd looking pretty good. We have Twilight Thursday going on as we speak. Last race a little after 8 o'clock tonight. And as Rick mentioned, we'll have more of these events going on the rest of September into early October as well. Numbers outside right now, 84 degrees. It's kind of muggy as well. Humidity, double nickels there at 55%. A south wind between 5 and 10 miles an hour. The radar scan is clear. Any plans you have on this Thursday evening? Going to check out a couple of races still. There's still some time. Otherwise, grilling out, whatever the case may be, enjoy. 84 now will slip into the low 80s, 7 o'clock tonight, heading towards the upper 70s by 9 and 10 o'clock with clear skies and quiet conditions. And that's what we've had for the better part of this day. Had a little bit of low cloud and fog activity this morning. Those quickly burned off though by the middle of the day. And we're gonna hold on to mainly clear skies tonight. There could be some patchy valley fog in random locations, but overall it won't be nearly as thick as what it was this morning. Temperatures when you wake up on your Friday morning, pretty good stuff. Middle and upper 60s in the outlying regions to that warmer 70 as it typically is in downtown Louisville. Nice and quiet on your Friday morning. Uh, and as we move deeper into the day, a mix of clouds and sunshine. Hey, listen, it's going to be a warm, humid day. That humidity will be ramped up just a little bit, and that could give rise to maybe a stray shower here or there. Most of us will stay dry. 98% of us will stay dry tomorrow. Everybody will heat up, however, on your Friday afternoon. We're looking at plenty of temperatures in the mid and lower 80s for the most part. There could be a couple of upper 70s peppered in where the clouds are a little bit thicker, but in downtown Louisville, expecting 86 degrees. Into and through your weekend, it is the last full weekend of the summer season. Flying by, isn't it? Here's what's gonna happen. High pressure is gonna build into the Ohio Valley from the west and southwest. This is way up in the upper levels. Whenever you have a pattern like this, especially this time of the year, it warms up. And it is going to be a warm September weekend. We're talking 88 on Saturday, 85 Sunday. Still a slight chance for an isolated shower or storm. But again, plenty of dry time pretty much all weekend long. It's next week. Rain chances really start to ramp up, and here's why. Strong cold front will be approaching our area Monday and Tuesday. Tuesday night and Wednesday it'll pass through. Folks, the first batch of what looks to be true autumn-like air will be building in during the day Wednesday. How fitting, right? The first day of autumn is Wednesday. That high pressure originating off to the west-northwest will bring that cool air in here for mid and latter portions of next week. So here's our forecast for this evening. Fair skies, dry, quiet. will slowly drop back through the 70s. Your seven day forecast will wake up to 70 in the morning. 86 tomorrow, two better on Saturday. Maybe a stray shower, but most will stay dry. 85, quite a few clouds Sunday, but it does look mainly dry. Then those rain chances start increasing Monday, Tuesday, Tuesday night. By Wednesday morning, the front passes through. Look what happens, guys. Those high temperatures in the low 70s, the first day of autumn, next Wednesday and Thursday, lows at night will be in the 50s and 60s. And beyond the seven day, I think next, yeah. next Thursday night, Friday morning, we have a chance of being in the 40s. Really? 40s? 40s for lows. I, listen, I can't wait. I mean, 40s. I 40s, love, though? I love. That's, a big, that's a big drop. Yeah. That's a oh. big, big drop. Yeah, this air coming in from Canada. So. All right. We'll get out and enjoy that this weekend here. <laughs> I can't a little urgency now. <laughs> Thanks, Jack.